certified free. Hanging my dust and she learning my lingo. Back then, wasn't worried about me, dog. In the gym. Let's do it. It's a beautiful morning. It is currently 544. Meeting the sauce man in Naperville at 745. Hopefully I can meet some crackheads on the red line. This is a purple line express. Ready to ride? It's Brittany. <laughs> there he is. The chauffeur. You have your fucking feet on my dashboard? No. My pants were coming for your ass. We like to fly on your fucking head. We're coming for you. Unlike his wife, who's never came for him. <laughs> I'm gonna give all my secrets away this time. Another perfect life. Yeah. Oh. Hey guys. Saw some cupboard here. We're in the middle of butt fuck Indiana. And, um,. Sauce and I just ordered $35 worth of Taco Bell. <laughs> the fucking lady on the speaker, we finished and she goes, <laughs> anything else? She had no room to say that. She had no room. Then we got to the window and she <laughs> took up the whole fucking window. <laughs> like, the fuck? Oh, I almost joked. Um... Not fat shaming. <laughs> no, well, I was fat. I was once fat. Would never ever fat shame. Cause but, like, we're fucking eating Taco Bell as we speak. And later we're gonna go smash like 30 wings. Precisely. the trader uh so essentially i'm sorry uh essentially we have found this radio station here in kentucky that is dedicated to essentially being a verbal facebook marketplace so people are calling in and over the radio they're saying hey we've got this to sell it's been i mean we've heard shit like uh i have this lady called in and said i got 30 parts for weed eaters if you need any kind of weed eater parts, just go ahead and call me. One dude, one dude was like, "Yo, I got this pickup, two wheel drive, not four wheel. I'm trying to sell it for sell a tray about fifteen hundred dollars. Like, I'll take a, I'll take a four wheeler if so, you got one." Somebody called in and was like, "Hello, I have <laughs> not only chickens and hens, I have ring neck pheasants and turkeys he's like well i know a gene gene will take out here's his phone number here's his shop number but it's probably so, better if you call his real number so we're gonna we're gonna turn the volume back up and uh we're gonna listen in on some of the stuff that they're doing here on the train there's a chill there's a child in the station <laughs> Hold on. Oh my god, are we losing it? Hello, uh, happy 16th birthday today. Happy 16th birthday to our grandson. Is her grandson even listening to the radio station? She just called in to wish her grandson a happy 16th birthday. <laughs> we'll take another call. Yes! Good afternoon, you're on the trader. Well, hello there, Miss Bailey. How are you this afternoon? Good. <laughs> Well, that's oh. good. Would you care if I put a few things on the trader? <laughs> they don't? 
Okay, I have got a pulling lawn mower. It's a John Deere. Something that you want to need, but huh? Yeah, I don't know, baby. Oh, yeah, that's what you need to get Dad there. To get him off the couch then, see? Yeah. Yeah, it's one of a kind. Now, it's a really a nice, nice, nice mower. When I say nice, you know I mean nice. It's ready to go to the track. It's caught a meal on his wrist. Hey, black, black, what a bad ass. I, I went and got the bag and now everything lit. I went and got the bag and now everything lit. We here. Hear me out. Hear me out. If I wasn't so dedicated to the brand of North Central College, this is a, this is a pretty nice school. Got a couple of friends that go to school here. Maybe graduate program? <laughs> I'm not going to graduate school. I'm just fucking with you guys. <laughs> definitely not the nicest Airbnb I've ever stayed in. It's definitely not the worst. Hey man, fuck the Yankees, am I right? You know what's bad? I brought a Yankees jersey with me. <laughs> That's my outfit for tomorrow night. Sleeping Beauty. What? I said my little Sleeping Beauty. I'm just laying here. Oh. Did you get a good night's rest? Mm-hmm. Let's get some breakfast. Six. <laughs> it's my little baby. You know, we out here, we're doing this shit. And we're, this, this trip would not be complete without kissing the big red statue. Now, I can hear that there's a car coming up behind me to the left. I'm gonna wait for that car to leave before I give this statue a kiss. <laughs> There's more cars now, so we're just gonna, we're just gonna go ahead. We're just gonna go ahead, and we're gonna give this big sexy motherfucker a kiss. Mwah, I fucking love this bitch. I love this big fucking red crackhead. I feel like I'm wearing a flag. Sauce, so, how many X's is this? Pits and traps are so good together. How many, how many, how many X's is this? That's a 4X shirt. I wear a large. Oh, we rated Tyler's. This is my hat. I just bought it. But we, everything else that we're wearing right now is Tyler's. Including our boxers. Networking. Networking. Moonshine Throwdown Podcast. We're, we're networking at the moment. We're, we're basically, we're in. Yeah, hey, hey. Warren, we're doing so. We're out here, we're out here kissing babies and your mom. Hold on, we're out here meeting people. We're, we're meeting the people. I'm excited. I'm really excited. 
excited. Um, this, is, hey, this is what we came here for. I just have to say my, my fetish is Big Red. That is all, that is all. Uh, I'm sexually attracted to Big Red. Things that turn me on, Big Red. That's it, end of list. So, is she looking at what I'm looking at? That's a big boy. That's a big boy. Yes! Let's go! Well, it was, uh, it was an eventful day, to say the least. Uh, the rain let up for the game, which was good. Um, we yelled a lot. Uh, we got a lot of odd looks, uh, unfortunately, for the boys. They came up a little bit short today. Um, but it's okay, because now we're here with our friend. Hey. We're here to make him feel better. Hey, buddy. Hi. It's a tradition unlike anything else. Not SEC football. Me getting punched in the chest by Tyler Witt. Tonight might be the night that I get murdered. His parents are here to witness. Oh, jeez. <laughs> uh, but we're going we're gonna to run it back. We did it last year. But... Oh! <laughs> Let's try it again this year. Tyler, have at it, kid. Because he just lost a game, too. I'm, I'm about to get fucked up. Shit! He didn't catch me under the titty like he did last year. It more was mid titty. Uh huh. That was that was. They'll be bruised tomorrow. At least he's not out of breath like last time. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> 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 All right, let's go out. <laughs> Gentlemen are uh, setting up a, a, a group chug here. Basically, here, there's no COVID. Basically, not sober. Whoa, 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 whoa. I woke up this morning and my entire left hip was soaking wet. No, it wasn't piss. Woody smelled it for me. It was not piss. We don't know what it was. But hey, 10 out of 10 night. A similar tattoo when it comes to the trees, but like the scene of it all is really unique. Yeah, there's another school. Hmm? Play something sad since we're leaving. I'm sad? Yeah. So take the photographs and I'm still fine taking your no. mind. Your lyricist is right behind you. I don't know how to play that. Hanging on a shelf in good health and good time. <laughs> Tattoos and memories and asking on. I don't know all the words. See ya. Well, Sauce, the weekend is sadly coming to an end. Yeah, they always go by so quick, but both times we've been down here, I mean, how fun has it been? It, it, we've only been down twice. We're two we're, for two. Two for two. We're betting a thousand. Yeah. Well, Chef's kiss of weekends. And we should say uh, quickly as we wrap this video up, the guys on the football team here at Western Kentucky treat us like royalty. King at the Kings. end of the day, we're nobody. We're a couple We're groups. just two guys trying to start a podcast and make it big. And we're presented by a media company that's also trying to make it big as well. Um, but we got to thank the guys on the Western Kentucky football team. They are the absolute best. We could not come down here without their help, uh, giving us a place to stay. Um, sometimes they feed us as well. So... Big shout out to those guys. But Cub, this is the end of the roadie and the first vlog of vlog of the Miscall Podcast. We hope you enjoyed. Again, this is the end of the roadie part two. All I got is missed calls on my line. Yeah, never seen a pickup.